Hey guys, it's Destiny Lachey. So today I'm coming to you guys with a affordable everyday makeup tutorial. I hope you guys enjoy it. So let's get started. First, I'm going to start off with my NYX Honey Do Me Up Primer. I am going to put this all over my face and I'm going to massage this in to my skin. I really like this primer. As you can see, it's empty. <laughs> so now I'm going to color correct. So I do have some acne scarring. I am testing out a new skincare routine and a new cream and all that stuff. So um, they told me my skin would purge. So yeah, it's purging. <laughs> so I have to correct some dark spots that I got. And I'm going to go in with my Dewy and Smooth um, Maybelline foundation in the color Coconut. And I'm going to put this on the back of my hand and I'm going to make little dots all over my face on top of my corrector. And I'm basically just going to blend out the foundation afterwards. I'm going to use my Real Techniques brush that I always use and I'm going to spray it with some Mario Badescu spray so that it blends really evenly. And I'm just going to pat the foundation all over my skin. Um, the reason why I color correct using a orange concealer is because it cancels out the darker areas very well. I've tried using a regular concealer and I've figured out that the orange just works better for me. And you can't see the darkness, like the dark scar through my foundation. So I really like that. So now I'm brushing up my eyebrows. Today I'm using this Wet n Wild Mega Clear eyebrow gel to hold my brows in place and then I'm going to use my Ben Nye banana powder and I'm going to set my eyebrows so that um, they're not so oily and I can um, kind of work with putting on my eyebrows because if they're super duper oily I just can't I don't know I can't draw them in <laughs> so I'm actually going to bake my eyelids as well and this just prevents um, oil seeping through my eyelids as well all day and then I'm just going to sweep away that powder now I'm going in with my NYX brow pencil. I'm just going to go ahead and fill in my brows with that. So this is basically how I fill in my brows. Just like a quick tutorial. I do plan on doing a full detailed eyebrow tutorial very soon. But this is what I use generally for like my drugstore makeup tutorials. Um, I'll use this and then you'll see in a second I use another product as well. I'm just filling them in, making little small strokes towards the beginning of my eyebrow and then kind of making it more bold towards the end of my brow. Um, this is very easy. I really, this pencil is grown on me. I kind of like it now. <laughs> you definitely have to work with it a lot more than the Anastasia Brow Wiz, but that's okay. This pencil is a fraction of the cost, so I can deal with it not working as well. But I'm going to go in with my e.l.f. cream liner in the color black and I'm going to kind of make my eyebrows a little bit darker because my hair is always jet black and I want my eyebrows to match. And this just sharpens them up just a little bit as well and I really really like that look. So yeah, I'm sorry. I was just checking on my daughter because she's always there while I'm filming. So <laughs> yeah, I'm just going to kind of draw little hairs in there. So now I'm going in with my L'Oreal Carbon Black Mascara and I'm going to put that um, on my eyelashes so that my falsies mesh well with my real lashes. So now I'm using my Salon Perfect um, 614 lashes um, and I get these from Walmart and I'm just going to apply these to my lash line. So now I'm using my NYX HD concealer. I really like these concealers. I use the color Nutmeg. I'm using that color right now and I'm just applying that um, underneath my eyes to conceal underneath my eyes as well as highlight and then I'm going to go in um, with the color tan I believe everything will be listed in the description box so check that out um, and then I'm going to use my beauty blender to blend out my highlight underneath my eyes so this is going to conceal um, any dark circles that you have and it's going to also highlight your face and bring a life back to the face honey <laughs> so yeah and you can actually use any sponge that you have you don't have to have a beauty blender I prefer the beauty blender but you can use one of those cosmetic sponges the little triangle ones or you can get the real technique real techniques sponge that one's really good too so I'm gonna go back in with my banana powder and I'm going to set underneath my eyes so that it does not move or crease all day on me so I'm just going to I'm gonna bake today you guys know I haven't been wanting to bake lately like I don't know I just haven't been into it but I'm gonna bake today um, I usually bake 
when I'm doing like a simple face, like a no eyeshadow type look. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> don't ask me why, but I do. So now I'm going to highlight the bridge of my nose, Cupid's belt, and my chin. Not doing my forehead today because this is supposed to be like an everyday quick thing. So now I'm going to go ahead and brush away that powder. I am using, what am I using? Oh, the same Real Techniques brush to brush away that powder. Now I'm going in with my MSF by MAC in the color dark. And I'm going to kind of sweep more of the excess powder away as well as buff this in underneath my eye. I like this because it gives me that really photoshopped look and it just makes everything flawless. So now I'm going to go in with my CoverGirl Ebony Bronzer. And I'm going to bronze or warm up my face. Now I'm using my Sigma brush. This is the tapered highlighting, no, tapered brush. I'll put it in the description box. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to go along my, um, what is that, my cheekbones and my forehead just to warm up my face. I'm going to go on the sides of my nose, kind of pinch the brush a little bit, go on the sides of my nose, um, the inner part of my cubist bow, and a little bit below my lip. Now I'm going to go in with my Sonia Kashuk Bronzer and Goddess. Love this thing. And I'm going to highlight above where I bronzed up my face a little bit. And I'm just going to apply that like crazy. I love this stuff. It, it feels like you can never apply too much. Like, is that just me or? No. Nah. <laughs> but I love this stuff. And then I'm going to put some on the bridge of my nose the tip of my nose, a little bit above my lip and my chin a little bit. Now I'm going in with my NYX uh, lingerie lippies. I'm using the colors Beauty Mark first right here and then I'm going in with ruffle trim in the middle and I'm just going to pat my lips together and I'm going to spray my face with the Mario Badescu skincare rose water spray. I really like this. It's very hydrating. And I'm going to spray that all over my body and my face, obviously. <laughs> and that's really it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Don't forget to thumbs up this video and subscribe to my channel if you have not already. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.